here. This is my father. He used to be on the show a couple of times. All right, hey, Daddy. How you do, baby girl? How old are you? 70. 70, okay. 70, I know you're a Scorpio. You have one child, me. Yeah, um, the only one. Uh, what you do for a living? What would you say your profession is? Entertainer. He's an entertainer. And um, a realtor. And a realtor. Um, 70, Scorpio, one child. Um, lives in Connecticut. What kind of woman are you looking for? None. You looking for no woman? Why not? Nope, you're enough for me. I buy, you need a romantic lady in your life. No, if God bless me with somebody, that's what will happen. I'm going I'm, I'm to let the Lord pick it for me. Well, Daddy, you're seven years old. At some point in time, you're going to have to pick out for yourself. Yeah, that's true. But I can go to church and find a good woman. I can go to the shopping mall or the gym find a good woman. The shop. Well, what, 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 what don't you like? Let's start there. What, I, what don't I like? Yeah. Somebody lying to me. Someone lying to you? Okay. Somebody who can't cook. She got not to cook? She I definitely got know how to cook. Your mother knew how to cook. Okay, she got how to cook. You don't care if she has kids, right? Yes, I do. You care if she has kids at 70? Yes, I do. Why you care if she has because kids? Because you, you, you have to understand, I'm 70 years old. So the type of woman I'm going to date would be between the age of probably 60 on up. No, nothing under that age. And that means most ladies will have grown kids will be worse than baby kids. Grown kids are more protected of their mother, especially young men. I already want you that scene. That's why I'm by myself. So, oh, okay. so you want to date around your age? So 60 is the youngest? Yeah, I don't need anything younger than that. I already tried that. It didn't work out. So if a woman has a grown child, that's a problem. You couldn't date her? No, it's only a problem if the grown child's a problem. OK. I mean, you know. Does she got to look a certain way? No, it just got to be true. I don't care what she looks like. I'm not a, I'm no Denzel or Brad Pitt, but I'm OK, you know? Does she got to make a certain amount of money? No. no. I got the money already. Oh, he said he got the money already, child. Um, we got something called a Kendrick cam. That's what you're supposed to stand up. But I don't feel like showing your whole house off. So it's okay. We got to skip Kendrick cam. Um, uh, I'm not going to ask you this question. You can ask it. You don't got to. I don't want to. I don't want to ask you this question as your daughter. That's up to you. It's your uh, okay. Daughter. The question is, when's the last time you was intimate with someone? But I don't want you to answer. Because I don't want to know the answer. You know, I can tell you, it's been quite a while. It's been over five years. Either. Over five years, day? That's too long. Not really. I'm happy with my life. What I'm you good. mean, five years? You ain't answer the five it's years? Not, that's not important. You know, when when you're in a relationship, you should love somebody. And I mean, I don't get me wrong. That's a beautiful thing. Only if you both are on the same page of how you want to respond, how you want to make your love making. You got to tell each other how you want to be loved. Nobody can read your mind. So you have to tell me how you want to be loved. And because if I love you, I'm going to do what you say. But what's, let's say what happens if all of a sudden you get sick. You no longer can have, uh, be intimate. Am I, am I supposed to drop you? Am I supposed to leave you? Am I supposed to go find someone who could still be intimate? I have to love you a whole new way. And I can do that. I understand that, Daddy. But I feel like sometimes if you desire a relationship, you know, you can't, I think uh, what I've learned is some people get so comfortable with being single that it's hard for them to break out of single and get into a relationship. Well, and, and, and and I feel like if some people are okay, I, my dad's the kind of person that he says, he tells me all the time he's happy being alone. So if that's your, if that is your model, then it is what it is. But if you are a person who truly desires companionship with somebody else, you can't go too long because you'll get comfortable and then you won't even know how to co-relate with somebody else. Look, let me put it to you this way. I had a good woman and I messed it up, okay? I know how it is when you hurt somebody and break their heart. And matter of fact, when I did talk to her, the pain I gave her, because I had no really good excuse to leave her, just that, you know, I was feeling my old, some young girl, once again, some young girl got my attention. I had no business going that way. And this young girl did have a couple of kids. Now, the, the lady was okay, so I'm not going to blame her. I got to take the blame on me because God has blessed me with a good woman twice in my life, okay? But I messed up. So I look at it this way here. I know what it is to have somebody good. But right now, because my mind is really focused on you being happy, then your daddy's happy. I'm good with my life. I'm blessed. Okay, okay. Well, with that being said, he don't. I don't want none of y'all to be my stepmama, so we're not even going to get the contact information out. 
This was just that's for this right. one. You can't beat the most. Like, yeah, like, so I don't need no cousin becoming a stepmom. Yeah, You've got right. to be crazy. Yeah. So, all right, Daddy. Well, um, we're, we're, I'm not sharing how to reach out to him. This was just for y'all to witness. There will be no way for you to reach out to my father, given. That's right. Let me just say this to all the young ladies out there. You have the power to make your life any way you want. You are the blood's line of life. God's choosing you to give birth, not man, because man never has a good plan. But you ladies, believe it or not, you know how to plan, you know how to be tough, you know how to be strong. You, this, here's, a, here's a joke I heard at church one time. Jesus and God was having a talk, his son. And God said to Jesus, what do you think about man? And Jesus said, ah, you did okay, you, you could do better. And God said, if I'm missing the beat, I did. I made woman. Remember that. Uh -huh. There you have it. <laughs> All right, Daddy. <laughs>